Now we'll look at two examples of graphing basic linear inequalities in one variable. We first want to graph the inequality x less than three, which means you want to graph all the real numbers on the number line that are less than three. Each graph will begin with a circle or point, either an open or closed circle or point. The point is often called the endpoint of the solution. A closed or shaded circle or point is used to represent the inequalities greater than or equal to or less than or equal to. The reason the point or circle is closed is because the point is part of the solution. And an open circle or point is used for greater than or less than, and the reason the circle or point is open is because the point is not part of the solution. The graph then extends endlessly in one direction based upon the inequality, and this is shown by a line with an arrow at the end. So going back to our example, we have x less than three, and therefore three is not part of the solution, so we make an open circle or open point on three, and then because it's x less than three, we draw an arrow to the left where values are less than three. This is the graph of x less than three. Let's look at a second example. Here we want to graph the inequality x greater than or equal to negative four. So because of the inequality symbol, notice how negative four is a solution, and therefore we graph a closed circle or closed point on negative four. And then because it's x is greater than or equal to negative four, we draw an arrow to the right where values are greater than four. This is the graph of the inequality x greater than or equal to negative four. I hope you found this helpful.